Hello everyone, this is TechBizmo, and welcome back once again to another video. In this video, everyone, we are going to be taking a look at scaling in KDE Neon. Anyways, guys, let's go ahead and get started. So basically, what is very, very uh, useful in the KDE Plasma desktop environment is that you have a scaling uh, scrubber thing, which is very fantastic for you people with high-resolution displays that like to, you know, use Linux. So I'm going to be showing you guys how you can change the scaling in the Plasma, KDE Plasma desktop environment. Anyways guys, as I said, let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing that you want to do is go ahead and open up your display settings. You can do this two ways, by typing displays in your menu if you have your menu, or just go ahead and head over to your settings, and you know, go to your system settings, and then head over to displays. So there's your two ways you can do it, I'm sure there's more, but you know. I really don't care. <laughs> Anyways, uh, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and click on this little button that says Scale Display over here. Um, and keep in mind, this is uh, uh, this is in the Displays setting. So go ahead and click on Scale Display. And now you will have this little scrubber that says Scale. And at the top it says Scaling Changes will come to into effect after restart. So yes, this is true. Not all scaling will change until you completely restart your computer. So that's just, I just mind you, uh, there's just something you want to know um, when you're scaling. So yeah, you're going to need to restart your computer after scaling. So I'm on, I'm currently on a 1920 by 1080 uh, resolution display, and I personally love the default scaling with this laptop, especially in the KDE Plasma desktop environment. However, this will still be useful for you people that are first, for say on a uh, smaller display with a higher resolution than me, um, or you know, <clears throat> you might just have bad eyes. For example, my dad he doesn't really have good eyes. I believe it's actually, I believe it's actually his right eye that isn't that good. Anyways, let's switch back to Linux. Um, so what you want to do? Just go ahead and move this scrubber to wherever you want to start scaling. So yeah, right here we are going to. I guess we'll scale to. Um, you know, it will scale to 1.3. So, as you can see right there, it is indeed scaled to 1.3. I forgot you could also full screen it if you want. <laughs> um, yeah, so it, as you see, it says scaling changes will come to an effect after start, after restart. So, yeah, well, go ahead and click OK if you are ready to restart your computer. And um, after you clicked OK and closed the window, it is time to restart your computer. Hello, and welcome back after a restart. As you guys can see, we have finished scaling the display after the restart. Everything has, you know, scaled, and it looks very nice. Um, I will mind you guys, I will not be um, switching to this scaling because I, li I like using the default scaling. It's good enough for me. Um, but yeah, here is some before and after pictures. So, yeah, there's a before and after pictures of the menus. Um, well, anyways, guys, it has come towards the end of this video now. Thank you guys very, very much for watching this video. Be sure to comment, like, and subscribe, and don't forget to check out my website in the link below. Also, uh, to remind you, please uh, let me know what you guys think, and let me know if this video was helpful and useful. Did you like it? Did you dislike it? Uh, just let me know in the comments below. Do I need to change? Is it beyond repair, and do you want me to throw away my computer? Um, you know, just let me know in the comment selection below. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Catch you in the next one.